Hey guys. Okay, so welcome to another book haul. I'm sorry it took so long. I have a ton of books for you guys today, so I'm going to try my very best to do them as quickly as possible. First book that I received was from Sherry Soul, and it's called Moonlight Mayhem. And it is actually the sequel to Beautifully Broken, which is a young adult urban fantasy set in a small town called Whispering Pines. And it's got magic, it's got witchery, it's got demons, and it's hella scary. So you should probably check that out for Halloween. Talking Pictures by Ransom Riggs, which is a book just about pictures. The stories that some pictures tell are heartbreaking. I'm actually going to do the giveaway announcement now so that I can get to the books and I can just go on from that. So I'm going to be giving away Why We Broke Up by Daniel Handler and Myra Kalman. It is actually the hardcover. So if you're interested in winning, just stop by my blog starting October the 16th and all the way to November 16th for a chance to win. So yeah, this is what it looks like. Okay, since I have so many books today, I want to do a quick run through through them just so I can keep this video as clipped as possible. The first portion of my book haul is about the books that I bought online on Chapters and a good chunk of them were on sale and a few of them weren't, but I saved a lot of money by getting a lot of them on sale. So yeah, so the first book that I actually got from Chapters, which was not on sale, is called Obsidian by Jennifer L. Armand Trout, which is a very popular book, apparently, and I've seen a lot of people very excited about the sequel. So hopefully I like this one so I too can get excited about the sequel. The next book that I got on Chapters Online is actually called Ash by Melinda Lowe, and this is actually one of the ones that was on sale. Another one that was on sale is a 1920s based novel. This one's called Bright Young Things by Anna Godberson. This is the last one I think that was on sale is Swoon by Nina Malkin and I have seen this a lot and I actually did have it in my hands one time before and uh, because the this girl that worked at the chapters told me that it was actually a really good book but I don't know if I'm gonna like it or not. I got it on a whim because it was on sale and because I wasn't sure uh, Mostly because I had it in my hands before and I didn't get it. And I'm the type of person who, when I don't get a book that I had in my hands, I put it back. It usually haunts me until I finally decide to buy it. So yeah, that's the gist of that. But it's a beautiful cover. I think it's gorgeous. And it's so creepy. I like it. The Boy Recession by Flynn Minnie. I came across this book a while ago and it caught my attention and I really wanted to read it. I also got two other books from Chapters. Uh, the first one I have been wanting for a very long time. It's Gretchen McNeil's 10. Look how freaking awesome that cover is. The last one that I got from Chapters. It's called Confessions of a Murder Suspect by James Patterson. On to the big list of books from the secondhand store. The first book that I actually got was The Notebook by Nicholas Sparks. I have almost all of his books and happily so, that man knows how to make me cry. The next book that I actually got was Becoming Scarlet by Kira Girati. If I mispronounce your name, I'm sorry. James Kahn's Poltergeist. Another one that I got was actually the sequel of Wicked. Um, it's called The Son of a Witch. I bought it because even though I haven't read the first book, I do own it. Next book that I actually got was Judy Bloom's Here's to You, Rachel Robinson. And I've read her forever book, uh, so I'm not entirely new to Judy Bloom, but we'll see what I think about this one when I get to it. The next book that I got was Heathen Girls by Luann Jones. Insurgent by Veronica Roth. Why would anyone leave this at the secondhand store? Margaret Peterson Haddix is Found. It's the first book in the Missing series. Alligator by Lisa Moore. It's just an alligator, but it's neat and creepy at the same time. The next book that I got is Nicholas Sparks' The Wedding. Yes, another Nicholas Sparks book. And yeah, this man has my heart. He's amazing. The next book that I got was Vampire Kisses by Ellen Schreiber. Vampires. Melissa Mars Carnival Souls and it's actually an advanced reader copy. Why would someone bring that to the secondhand store? 
I don't know. Am I happy that they did? Yeah, because that means that I get it and I don't have to pay the outlandish price at chapters for it. All right, so that is it for this week. And hopefully next week I'll have some more books for you. Hopefully not this many because this is a crazy book haul. But that's about it for today, guys. And I hope to see you next week. Bye.